guys and gals, this is Dave, Classic Gamers HQ. Thank you for joining me with the playthrough, complete playthrough of Black Mesa. This is the remake of the original Half-Life. It is years, or has been years in the making. Um, if you're a Half-Life fan, if you're a video game fan, you should know what Half-Life is. Good morning, and welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. So this little intro this right here looks very familiar. Is provided for the security and convenience of the Except Black Mesa Research twist. Facility The graphics personnel. have been greatly increased. The time is 8.40. In fact, they've been redone completely. Current topside temperature Character models is redone. 93 degrees. Everything. With an estimated high of... Half-Life was released in November of 1998. Five. It was the number the one selling game for is maintained at a, pleasant a couple of years there, I think. And, and uh, a lot of spin-offs from Half-Life have become popular over the years as well. Black Mesa was just released last week. Um, this is September 2012. And uh, Black Mesa's been in the works for, oh, at least five, six years now. Um... And uh, they promised to uh, release a complete remake of the original game in its entirety, uh, pretty much in its original state, aside from updated graphics, music, sounds, so on and so forth. This train is inbound from Level 3 Dormitories. Now, to Steam. Sector C test uh, lab is a and control facility. Provider, uh, if uh, your intended destination is, is a high security area beyond has created Steam, Sector which, uh, C, you will need is a to digital content to the provider type in system, area nine, which came out several years ago and when Half-Life 2 was uh, was created or was released. If you have not yet Steam your did release the, the Half-Life source version, you must report to Black which Mesa didn't have updated graphics, it did have before updated, you will be permitted uh, into the high security branch of the transit system. It was updated with source engine, different effects uh, included in that game, including ragdoll effects, that was the main improvement with that. See the outside environment there has been updated. Very Due to nice. the high toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound, no smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the yeah, Black now Mesa this, transit system. This stays system. with the original. Uh, it's pretty parallel to the original, except for the improved graphics. This is very impressive. You can see the details they've added. Very excited about playing through this game. I was going to do a CGHQ playthrough of the original Half-Life, but Black Mesa got released. I had no idea it was going to be released Please last keep week. Keep your limbs inside the train at all times. So I had to jump right. Do not on. attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. Absolutely. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instructions. But a couple of spin-offs of Half-Life, you've got, uh, you know, Deathmatch, you've got Counter-Strike, uh, you've got Blue Shift. Uh, Counter-Strike to this day is still to an you know, the most popular title, period, in PC gaming history. So Half-Life started it all. I don't know. You guys comment between Half-Life and the Unreal series, which the Unreal series is what I'm going to be doing next. I'm going to play through Half-Life 1 here, and then I'm going to start on the original Unreal and go through Unreal Tournament, Unreal 2, and Unreal Tournament uh, 3, you know, just go down the line, UT 2004, UT 2003. I might skip UT 2003, though, because 4 and 3 were pretty much one and the same. Four was uh, more like additional maps added to three. So we are on the pseudo subway here, just like in part one, making our way to the laboratory area where. Um, 
where Gordon Freeman is going to meet up with a few scientists, uh, co-workers of his, and conduct some type of experiment. Now, if you've never seen this game before, and you don't know the story behind it, I'm not going to divulge too much information. And so... Uh, a reminder that the Black Mesa Hazard Course in Decathlon will commence this evening as at I don't 1900 hours in the Level 3 right facility. The semifinals for high while, security personnel game, will be so, announced uh, in a separate secure broadcast transmission. Uh, Remember, years, more say, life than yours may depend on your fitness. Yeah, so it's going to be a great run through. This is almost a blind run through. Eh, not quite, but almost. Close enough. We're at the Anomalous Materials Laboratory. You see them conducting some experiments here and there. Do you have a friend or relative who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team? Immediate openings are available in the areas of Materials Handling and Low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high tech disciplines, please contact our civilian recruiting team. The Black Mesa facility is an equal opportunity employer. Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of completed employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a schedule of your analysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. But I love deathmatch. If you feel that you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Yikes. Now arriving at Sector C test labs and control uh, facilities. Buddy, I guess that was supposed to be Barney. Elevated train, please. What's up, bro? Loading, loading, loading. And they got multiple loading times between each section of the game. So that's, that's, uh, they could have dealt away with that, but I think they want to try to keep so original or keep uh, to the game. Morning, Mr. Freeman. To the original Looks like game. you're running keep close to the original game as possible. So those loading times are very familiar as well. You know, Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. No, you're not Barney, huh? Guess his bar tab must have finally caught up with him. <laughs> so I'm going to use this time to, uh, well, I'm going to go throughout the entire game and just kind of explore. I'm not going to blow through it. I'm going to explore around, talk to folks, try to find any secret, you know, whatever's uh, in the game. So I'm just going to... Put some pep in that step, Freeman. I you're understand, late enough as it is. Why you even bother putting in extra hours down at the hazard course? <laughs> like you'll ever do more than flip a switch or push a button around here. Yeah. To think, Mom wanted me to waste my money sleeping through college courses when now I'm getting paid to sleep out here. <laughs> Go on, get. No. How am I supposed to catch my beauty sleep when you're staring at me like that? Uh, sorry, bud. I'll meet up with you after my shift's over. Hey, catch me later. You, me, and Calhoun will go out and get that beer he owes you. Yeah, Calhoun, huh? Oh, sorry, Doc. I have to stay at my post. Uh, can we do this later? Uh, sure. Not now. 
I'll, I'll stop by when I'm doing my rounds. Oh, okay, you do that. Oh, sorry, Doc. I have to stay at my post. Uh, can we do this later? Sure, why not? Can't do it. The Mac Blasa fire extinguisher. Keep upright, pull out pin. <laughs>